Hello my friends, today I am going to show you how to unlock stuck images in your Photoshop for free, full resolution, high resolution images that you can just use on your projects. The way you unlock this feature, you go to your Creative Cloud over here, you open your Creative Cloud, and then you go to Plugins. You can either click here or from this drop down menu, choose Plugins, and then type in Stock. Enter. So now you see the stock plugins that works with your program. Now be aware there's a lot of them like Shutterstock, um, iStock, those are all stock programs, Getty Images, and they're free, but the plugin is for free when you have to use an image, you actually have to pay for it. The one that I recommend and I use all the time it's this one over here. It's Pexels. It's a uh, stock images and they're all free, copyright free. You can use them as you please in your uh, projects. So you will click get, you will have a button like this that says get for you. I, mine is already installed, it shows it's installed. And within just one click, the Pexel plugin will be installed into your Photoshop. Let's go to Photoshop. And here you will find your plugin under plugins. You see Pexels over here. I have mine docked into the side because I use it all the time, so I like to have it handy. Now, when you are on the Pexel plugin, you will just search for whatever photo you need, or you can go by these uh, categories over here. So if you need the sky for sky replacement, you'll click on the skies, and you can scroll through and get like really nice skies that you can use for your sky replacement. You can also search for something. For example, I'm gonna show you here. I'm gonna type in chipmunk. So now I'll get all these images of chipmunks. Now, this is, you see, Skylar Ewing, this is me. I donated about almost 5,000 photos and videos to Pexels for you guys to be able to use it for free. So all these chipmunk photos over here, all well, a lot of them, they're mine. Is Skylar Ewing on it? And um, in order to use them on your project, what you do, let's use this one over here. You just click on it, and with one click, it will load it into your project as a layer. You see over here on the right? Now, this is a clip layer, so you just have to click Option and click on between the lines and now it's a regular layer as a smart object. And these are very high resolution images. Let's see if I zoom at 100%. Watermark free, you see that? Sharp. And all of these images, you can just use them for absolute free, no string attached, has no watermarks. And um, yeah, now like any stock images, you cannot just download them and sell them on your own. That is against the rules, but you can use them for your presentations, photo editings, compos composites, and all so. Now, when you look at the image on Pexels over here on the scroll down, if you find an artist that you really like their styles and you would like to see more photos from them, you cannot scroll, you cannot type in the artist name over here. So if I type in Skylar Ewing and search, it will show up all these photos, but those are not my photos, you see? Those are by this artist. So in order to find this artist's portfolio, you will do, let's go back to Chipmunk. So you will have to find one of their photos and then if you click on their name over here, it will take you to Pexels and you will see their portfolio. So if you click on, on it, you can follow them and you can see all of their photos and videos and you can just download it directly from here. You will just click on this download button and it will automatically go into your downloads on your computer. So this is my photos that I donated and you can use those free of charge anytime you need them for a project. There's a lot of them. Like I said, I donated over 5,000 images or around 5,000 images. My computer is loading slowly. 
but anyway that is for you to look into it and this is how you use stock images for free directly into your photoshop my name is Skylar Ewing thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video